As a self-employed mortgage broker or business owner, it's easy to forget about your own personal development. In the mortgage world, we get filled with CPD, product knowledge, but I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about your own personal development. As an employee, if you're lucky, then you get fed personal development. However, as soon as you step into the self-employed world, having to fend for yourself, personal development goes to the bottom of the list. Too busy trying to generate leads, look after our client, getting frustrated again by another lender chain. There are so much more important things to be done. So what do I mean by personal development? Well, I mean you, your learning, your personal development. As a mortgage broker, sole trader, firm owner, if you look back over the last year, two, three years, you will have developed as a person. You will be a different person now to what you were 12 months ago, two, three years ago. You will have developed. However, is that down to proactive development or reactive development? You will accelerate your development if you're proactively learning. How do you personally develop? How do you learn? Does reading work for you? Then look at personal development books. There are plenty out there. And yes, there are some that are a complete waste of time. However, there are some real great books out there that will help with your personal learning and your personal development. Look at the reviews. Look at what people are saying about that book. And do you relate to the reviews? Talk to other people that are proactively developing. Talk to other brokers that are proactively developing. What do they read? What are they reading? What was the last book that they read? If listening to your thing, then have a go at audiobooks, podcasts. Podcasts are a great way to learn and develop. There are some amazing podcasts out there. The benefit of podcasts is the free. They will help you learn and develop. Again, there are some podcasts out there that are a waste of time. However, there are some amazing podcasts out there that will help with your development and your learning. The beauty about podcasts is that you can listen to them while you're driving, while you're walking, while you're working, while you're on hold again to another lender. If listening or reading is not your thing and you prefer to watch something, then YouTube is a great source. Again, the beauty about YouTube is that it's free and again there are some amazing channels out there that will help with your learning and your personal development. Subscribe to those channels, subscribe to those people that you want to listen. As a self-employed mortgage broker, no one is going to be proactively helping you develop and learn. You have to take responsibility and ownership for your own learning and development. Some of the best brokers I know take time out of their busy lives and their busy schedules for personal learning and personal development. For me, self-development and learning is important. I read and I listen to podcasts. Structuring my week to make sure I have time to develop myself is one of the key things that I do every single week.